Since Metro started using body cams, we have all been able to see for ourselves how quickly volatile situations can take a dangerous turn. Well, tonight, new information about the sheriff trying to get even more body cameras. 13 Action News reporter Parker Collins walks us through the highlights of a year long body camera study. From NFL player Michael Bennett detained on the strip to an armed naked man running outside of a valley church, even to one October. Metro's body cameras show us all the chaos officers see when they respond. There's one thing most Las Vegans will agree on while watching these videos. You feel more comfortable knowing these officers have these cameras. Oh, absolutely. I think the body one cameras moderate the behavior of both officers and citizens. Now they have numbers to back up how valuable body cameras are in risky situations. The study created two groups of Las Vegas officers, one with cameras and one without. The findings are strong. A 30% drop in officers doing the wrong thing. A 37% drop in police getting violent. Plus, the cameras have cleared the names of hundreds of accused officers, while at least one officer was fired because of video evidence. And body-worn cameras have brought out the positive of law enforcement and the professionalism of this part department. The study says body cameras could save Metro $4 million a year in legal fees. That's why Metro wants to buy even more, above the nearly 2,000 that are rolling now. Parker Collins, 13 Action News. And a link to the full study is up on our website, plus more information on how Metro uses body cams. That's at KTNV.com.